special computerized glasses that would help people with very poor vision, very limited vision, augment it by having the computer identify particular objects. There'd be tiny cameras built into the frame so that you, and as well as that little LED lights built into the lenses. So the computer would constantly be scanning sort of what the subject has in their field of view and then using the LED lights to emphasize certain dynamics of it and not know that the person's wearing this fancy computer on their face, but in fact just has a, a, a very sly pair of shades. It might use color to differentiate objects based on depth so that you don't bump into them. It might say when you see someone, it might say, hey, that's Bob Murphy, and here's Bob Murphy's Twitter account, and sort of give you that extra sense of information. Or it might just be a zoom feature where, you know, it, it'll take something that you normally wouldn't be able to see from that distance and zoom it up so you can see it a little easier. So imagine really smart reading glasses that, you know, instead of having to have bifocals or to flip on a different pair, would instantly zoom the text up to a font size when you're reading the newspaper that makes it easier to comprehend. The larger cyborg trend as we become comfortable augmenting our biological capabilities with machines. You know, we've been doing that in terms of knee surgery and hip replacement, and in this case, laser eye surgery, except what this involves is embedding the computer between the eye and reality, whether via the glasses or a contact lens.